What's up guys, Chris George here and today we are reviewing Mountain Dew Energize, the no sugar variety. Now when I think of Mountain Dew, it kind of makes me have flashbacks to when I was a kid. Going to Pizza Hut, I'd always order Mountain Dew, it's kind of my favourite drink. I think KFC also used to sell it. I gotta say, I didn't know that it was an energy drink. I don't know if it was an energy drink back when I was a kid, as in the fact that it had caffeine or something like that in there. Because they never used the word energised on it, now they do. Now, Mountain Dew has been around an awful long time, since 1940 to be exact. Where'd the name come from? Well, I think it's actually slang for moonshine. And the people that originally invented it made the drink as a mixer for scotch and whiskey and, and alcohol products like that. Obviously, it's gone through a lot of changes over the years. It's now owned by Pepsi, and they've made a lot of variations to this drink. Just to name a few. Well, now we're in Australia, and we've got the Mountain Dew Energized No Sugar Variety. What does it taste like? Is it any good? Does it give you the energy that you need to do whatever you're doing? Well, let's give it a bit of a try. It's got a nice citrusy taste to it. And that's the thing about Mountain Dew. Is it citrus? Is it lemon, lime, fruit? Who knows? No one really, honestly, no one knows. Does anyone care? As long as it tastes good, that's what it comes down to. What's actually in this drink? Oh, there's all of this stuff. And as you can see, caffeine, which is a decent amount of caffeine there. So it's got a fruity taste to it, and that's quite pleasant. It's actually really refreshing. The problem with the drink, I guess, is it's got the artificial sweetener. And well, as artificial sweeteners go, it kind of changes the taste of the original. The original Mountain Dew without, with just normal sugar, it's got a more better taste, just to say that. But we're reviewing this one, and obviously if you're trying to avoid sugar, well, that's the one you're going to go for, isn't it? Does this give you the energy you need to maybe do this? Okay. It does make you feel a little bit more energized. Yeah, I'm not really sure to be honest, but I'm just saying that. Overall, the taste is good, it's refreshing, and when you want something caffeinated and you don't want cola, one of those monster balls, no that's not right, monster drinks or red balls, well this is a good choice. Like I said, maybe the normal one with sugar has got a better taste, you don't avoid that artificial sweetener, but if you want the no sugar one, that's the one you're going to go for. Anyway, I want to thank Grant from Film Learning who actually told me this drink was available, I did not know it was. I had been trying the other one occasionally, or just stick into like your monster drinks, because they got no sugar ones. But now this is my new drink, my fridge is packed with it, because I actually do like the taste. So there you go, Mon Monster Dew, that's not right is it, Mountain Dew Energized, no sugar variety. Anyway guys, hope you liked the episode, if you did give it a thumbs up, subscribe and leave a comment. There'll be more episodes soon, from, let's call this the snack booth. Yeah, that's going to work out.